Hi guys, it's Anna here. I'm an English and Spanish teacher from Russia. I'm also a teacher educator on Flipgrid and I really want to share with my epic ways of using App Smash Madness on Flipgrid. First of all, I'd like to share with you um, that my favorite ones are Quizlet, Kahoot, Booklet, and Sway. So, and where we can use them dealing with Flipgrid? Of course, we are talking about the project-based learning activities. So, a few words about project-based learning. So I got this information from pblworks.org. What is PBL? Uh, project-based learning is a teaching method in which students learn by actively engaging a real-world and personally meaningful project. That's what we are talking about. This is a really important thing. Now let me demonstrate what kind of project we are working on right now. As I said before, this is the latest project that we have been working with uh, my students so far and uh, we were lately asked by Kylie and her amazing students from Australia to tell them more about the Russian history and they were really curious about in the, this exact period the Great Patriotic War, Nicholas II and the 1905 Revolution, World War I and etc. You can see all of these periods they are listed and also we were thinking really hard how we can present this in the best way, in the most informative way that uh, her students can learn about it like uh, really nice. And I want to share with you with the very first visual app that we used to present this kind of information. Let me start with Sway. Sway, this is a friendly alternative to PowerPoint and as personally it's my real opinion because enter Sway, which is Microsoft's attempt to provide a lightweight, cloud-only storytelling application that is easier to use than PowerPoint and provides more narrative devices than simply slide after slide or bullet points. That's why uh, Sway is much more easier to use by your students. First, they can just press one button and they may decide, it's written in Russian, but I may say that they may decide, is it the title? Is it for text only? Is it for image? Is it like um, many pictures in a row? Also, they can choose a design of their presentation by using this constructor option. Just look at this. They can use uh, this way of uh, reading their presentation. Uh, they can use it in another way if they go to the styles. It can be in a vertical way. It can be in horizontal as it was before. And it can be like the slides, the simple one that we use mostly in PowerPoint, etc. They can use this amazing kind of um, visual design thing. They can use use it because it's more about the individual preferences and it's awesome it looks fantastic you see so what else can your students do with their sway presentations they can use another sway and its embed code and to insert that sway to this one or to another one by pressing share a button uh, your students will have uh, the ability to um, share with viewing option only or with the ability with making any kind of changes in the same sway. Uh, we need to paste, to copy, sorry, this kind of link, or we can share with the shareable link on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, or we can use the embed code of this sway presentation and to embed it to another sway presentation or to the uh, blog post and anywhere on your website, uh, I don't know, wherever you need it. So we just copy this shareable link with viewing option only and we go to Flipgrid. So I'm here in my Flipgrid account and all I need is to go to my grid uh, where we were working with my students, the history of countries around the world. There is the topic about Russia and the Russian history and, and absolutely empty. There is no um, like additional information and there is no app smashing things yet so but all i need is to press the edit topic button then i need to move uh down and here you can see that there is what is there there is topic attachments all i need is to paste my sway link and add the title i guess it's going to be history of russia and this is it I can add another attachment but it's going to be really soon update topic and wow it looks fantastic my sway presentation is in flipgrid it's awesome so i want to show you another tool which i usually use and like a lot it's wakelet